Okay, everybody, Matt here, Big Red Liquors, and today I've got uh, the latest from Beam Suntory, the new Basil Hayden 2x2 rye. And uh, starting with Little Book, and I, and I happen to agree with this, um, Beam has recognized the value of blending some of their whiskey uh, resources, and other people are starting to do this as well. Uh, using the Basil Hayden brand name for this whiskey, I mean, they could have used other brands, they could have done this as its own standalone brand, but basically it's a combination of two ryes and two bourbons and bottled at 80 proof. Um, the whiskey's ranging in the sort of five to nine year range. Um, and it's really an exercise in sweetness. So on the nose, I get that kind of fig, maple syrup, get a little bit of like rock candy, candied oranges. I always get sort of an orange note, which is I think the, that sort of yeast, orange yeast, chocolate orange, candied orange. Either way, it smells really sweet, uh, which is right up my alley. Let's taste it. Mm. It's actually pleasantly refreshing to taste an 80 proof whiskey. It's got a little bit of age on it. Um, super user friendly. Again, it's got that caramel vanilla toffee sweetness that travels right through. Uh, for having two ryes in it, there's not a lot of predominant spice whatsoever. Um, the finish is relatively short. Um, but it's sweet and you want to just keep going back to it, which I will right now. Mm. There's a little bit of that rye bite, but it's not much. Um, you know, this is a great whiskey to drink straight. Doesn't need ice. I wouldn't use it with that. Probably wouldn't make a Manhattan with it, but just as a straightforward really user-friendly, uh, really over-the-top sweet uh, whiskey. This 2 by 2 is fantastic. Um, I like the Basil Hayden lineup. Their dark rye was great. This is great. Um, I'm glad they're innovating in this space. Probably whiskey nerds are not going to love this because it doesn't have a massive age statement. It's not non-chill filtered. It's not bottled at, you know, 100 and, 110 plus proof. Fine. This is a whiskey to drink. Um, it's pretty straightforward, even though it's a blend, and it actually just tastes good, and that's all you need to know. Cheers.